a second, isn't that? Thank you, for, thank you for participation in this beta. Thank you for helping us create and improve this build. This build is a snapshot of our prog of our work in progress and prone to normal game development issues. You will see glitches, hitches, and even crashes. Some Xbox Live features may not work correctly. This software is purely as code. We cannot provide customer service in a traditional sense. However, feedback as you play and enjoy the game will help us improve and enhance the final product. Your contributions are an invaluable part of our success. Visit HeyWaypoint.com to act to discuss beta and provide feedback. Online interactions are not rated. Continue. Microsoft Studios. Before three industries. Creative assembly. May contain content inappropriate for children. to go walk through this gameplay video of Halo Wars 2 Open Beta. Um, there's one here playing Halo Wars 2 Open Beta. Yes. The game that was announced said nothing about, and then this was announced, and then now they're saying stuff about it. It is Halo Wars 2. The sequel to Halo Wars, a real-time a real -time strategy game based in the Halo universe about 20 years before the events of Halo 1, or just Halo Combat Evolved, and um yeah and by the way it was one of the fur it was one of the best rts's on console at the time and inspired other uh rts's to be more like it and actually make rts's fun on consoles uh much like k1 kind of evolved did the same thing with first person shooters instances of them inspiring other people command and conquer both command and conquer Tarbrian wars and command and conquer Railroad 3 and uprise no not uprising but well yes uprising but the other challenge mode, which I have forgotten. Both of them, uh... When I played the demos of them, I did play the better challenge mode, and they feel very heavily inspired by Halo Wars, which is... I good, which is good, because Halo Wars was unique, and actually made a fun RTS on console. Now, when it released, people were unsure, but an RTS on the console really why can't be on a computer, you know, like Halo... Like Halo... Like Halo 1 was? Uh, or like Halo, uh... Kind of evolved, as well as, um... Halo 2 Vista. Which, I don't know if they said anything about that. Um, but people came around and came to realize that the Wars was one of was one of the was one of the better Halos, let's say. Although people still hate it because it's a RTS game. People only hate other Halos for being first-person shooters. But anyway, so yeah. But this is its sequel. Now, Halo Wars 2 is actually slated for release in February. And um, what mouse? In February. 20, February 21st, 2017, uh, for both Xbox One, obviously, as I'm playing on Xbox One, and this demo is only, or I mean, in this beta is only for Xbox One, and Windows. Yes, it's going to be C as well. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, the developers created this in Blade for three industries, uh, decided, you know what, it'd be interesting, you know what, it'd be interesting to have this on PC, so they did. Which is something that people have been wanting for, wanting to have in Halo Wars for a long time. And Halo Wars never released on PC. There, people, you know, some people talked, you know, people talked about it as a rumor, but that's about it. Um, but yeah, another, another interesting thing about Halo Wars, it, that was actually my first Halo that I really played. Yes, I, I used Halo vehicles in other games, like, like X-Play Halo, Halo mods, like the Pelican, the Hornet, the Warthog. Um, all mods in Halo, all mods in x I use them. Uh, I did watch Red vs. Blue. Uh, I did watch trailers for Halo, but not a lot. Not until I actually got Halo. But yeah, Halo Wars was the first Halo game I actually played. And it was actually the first Halo game I put on the channel. Actually, it was the uh, second game I put on the channel. being Battlefield 3 being the first, but Halo Wars was the true start of my channel back in 20, 
uh, back in July, tw uh, back in July 21st, 2012. Um, so yeah, and it has influenced the channel ever since then. As Halo is still a major part of my channel, and strategy games are still a major part of my channel. Well, not really RTS is a little coming back, but yes, strategy games in general. But anyway, so what is Halo Wars 2? Well, uh, it is the sequel to Halo Wars. That is all I know. I have stayed away from all information, and this is the multiplayer beta, which I... You know, when this was announced just two, three days ago... Uh, and by the way, this is going on till, uh... This is going on till, uh... January... Uh, does it say on the thing? No, does it say it on... Waypoint.com, I wonder? It should say somewhere how long it'll be for. I believe it's either... I believe it's either June 20th or July 20th. They just got out... Um, the 13th of June, 2016. Yes, June 20th. All right. So June 20th, uh, 2016 is when they will end. And this actually, if I'm right, I'm, I'm not quite sure. But, I, I may have forgotten, but yeah, Halo Wars 2 may be the earliest open beta they have had for Halo so far. Not counting Halo, not counting Halo Online, because those open betas are insanely early. Uh, but yeah, for the mainstay series, uh, not like there's any other. Um, yeah, it's very early, because usually they're the same year of release. However, this is much, much earlier. Of course, this is coming out January, which is interesting. Halo hasn't released in January, hasn't released in the spring since... I don't even know when. Um, so yeah, that's interesting. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, let's get into this. Now this is no, I, I thought about, you know, I thought about having, I thought about recording this for one reason and one reason only. It's a multiplayer open beta. Which you say, are oh, you doing multiplayer open betas all the time? Yes. For games that are not RTSs, I really, really, really am bad at multiplayer RTSs. Well, except in co-op, I'm very good at co-op, but. Competitive? Nope, I'm not good at all. Um, you know that—that's one of the rare times you ever say, you ever hear me say, I'm not good at something. That and fighting games. I'm not good at fighting games either. That are not Super Smash Brothers. Um, so yeah, so this is gonna be interesting. But I decided, you know what? It's Halo. Let's do it. Um, I want to know more about Halo Wars 2. About Halo Wars 2. Download the latest configuration data. Let's start letting this game configuration data has been downloaded. The game will now restart. Welcome to Halo. Okay. Hey, 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 hey. Don't talk yet. Be right back. Oh, yes, and this thing is, by the way, like 13 gigabytes of space. And there is no trick in finding it. It's actually in the top demos right now. All you gotta do, if you don't find it, is hardly type in Halo Wars 2 in the search, uh, in the game search, and you should be able to find it easily. Okay. Let's get to the guy talking. Oh yes, uh, Halo Wars 1 was actually made by Ensemble Studios. I'm not quite sure. Is there the same people? Just a different name? Actually, let me look it up right now. Okay, Chris Dunley is a subsidiary of Sega. They're British. They may... <laughs> Oh, they come back. Oh, they they made some Total War games. And England Isolation. Huh. That's an interesting group of games. It's like it's like EA going to uh, Bioware and saying develop Command and Conquer. Uh, which they did and people didn't like, so yeah. Alright, let's go. It didn't phrase. I think if it did, we'd be kicked out. Oh, great. Just give it some time. Just like, uh, just like the newer Halos that came out. Oh, my mic is being weird. There we go. That's better. I believe this is when I say it's a beta. Okay, we're first time. Let's try this again. 
But yeah, and then this screen. Uh, yeah, I believe that's the arc in the background. And then you got Sekili fighting Marines. Although those could be the thing. Those could be the Sekili we meet in uh, uh, in Halo Five. The bad guys. I forget what they're called in Halo Five. I just call them Separatists, but yeah. I know, like I guess I know nothing about Halo 2. Halo Wars 2, mainly because I said nothing about it until now, and 2, I didn't want to know. I don't want to share my first impressions with you people. Okay, yes. so I would say Curious Emily is not in several studios, which is interesting. Okay, so this again. Here we go. Welcome to Halo Wars 2. My name is Captain James Cutter. Oh, hi, Cutter. It's important to keep an eye on the battlefield so you can react and plan your strategies accordingly. You can move your view around the map using the left stick. The right stick rotates the view. Now I'll show you how to select your units. Units need to be selected before you can issue orders. Units can be selected by moving the cursor over them and pressing the A button. Holding the A button paints a selection area over a group of units. Alternatively, tapping the right bumper will select all units on screen. Another way of managing your units is by assigning them to control groups on the D-pad. Once units are selected, the X button is used to issue orders, such as moving, attacking enemies, garrisoning structures, and capturing tactical points on the map. If you wish to take your units out of a garrison, press A to select the garrison and eject them via the radial menu. Resources and buildings. It's important that your base is receiving a steady flow of supplies and power so you can build the army you want. Supplies and power can be gathered on the battlefield from crates or by capturing and holding forerunner power nodes. You can build additional buildings at your base to produce infantry units, vehicle units, air units, or special units. You'll always start with a base, but as you move around the map, you'll find more empty slots to build additional bases. Your base isn't your only support on the battlefield. View and unlock your commander powers in the command tree. You can access the command tree by holding the view button at any point during the game. Any abilities you unlock will be accessible through the commander powers menu by pressing the left trigger. One of the most useful commander powers is the ability to heal units. If your units are low on health, target them and use the healing commander power to heal all units within the area of effect. Event tactics. In Halo Wars 2, Upgrading your base will advance your tech level. Higher tech levels will allow you to purchase more advanced units, upgrades, and buildings. Upgrade a base by selecting the central building and choosing the base upgrade option at the top of the radial menu. If you have multiple bases, your tech level is determined by your most upgraded base. Additionally, each building type has its own global upgrades and unit-specific upgrades. The combat in Halo Wars 2 uses a rock, paper, scissors approach. Infantry is defeated by vehicles, vehicles by air, air by infantry. Some units are counter units. They can be used against specific units, even if it breaks the rock, paper, scissors rule. Hmm. Good luck, soldier, and I'll see you on the battlefield. All right, thank you, got together. I'll do my best. Okay, uh, things are a bit different. Um, for one, it's more, I guess, modernized. Uh, more modern tactical game. Uh, I mean, Halo Wars has always been more of a tactical game, but now it's more like a tactical game as there's command points to capture instead of you just having their, you having a base, having their base, you try to capture more bases by, you basically capture expansion bases, stuff like that. Which is interesting. Also, they went for Rock, Paper, Scissors, which wasn't really in Halo Wars either. Uh, anything good attack, anything that was good attacking against, you know, like standard RTSs, so this is interesting. And this is what I was afraid of. They're just gonna throw us in here and expect us to not die instantly in multiplayer. 
I thought they had so many uh, action, but uh. I, mean, I saw Captain Keller sticking, I'm like, oh no, no way, are they just going to throw us in here? Which, if you're good at RTS's multiplayer, this should be no problem. Like, I can go into an, I can go into a first-person shooter multiplayer, I don't like to, but I can, and do fine, so yeah. Controller, alright. I, li I like how Captain Keller called the squares button, view button, so select. So, hmm. This thing has multiple names, I guess, because remember, Halo is the flagship franchise of uh, Xbox, just as much as Mario is of Nintendo. So yeah, so yeah. Um, oh, by the way, yeah, this, I, this is not on PC, yet anyway. Unfortunately, I didn't look, uh, but so far on the Halo website, which I'll link in the description to the, uh, link in the, description to the, Halo, Halo, the Halo 2 website page. Or, yeah, the Halo, what? The Halo Waypoint page. All right, yeah, I, I read this earlier, but yeah, once you complete a game of Halo uh, of Halo Wars, do you get a Halo Five Guardian skull right back? Uh, I wish it was only unique, but it's fine. Oh, okay, and then you also, and two more for your gold rip packs when you complete your fifth game. Huh? I mean, those are, shit, those are like playing Halo, those are like five games of Halo 5, five uh, War Zone games, so that's not too bad, actually. Especially if you like playing Halo Wars 2, but I wish, again, there would be something unique. I wish you get their armor. Um... But anyway, uh, yeah, and my one, <gasps> over, uh, two things, uh, one, Hornets are back, I love my Hornets, uh, I wish they weren't Halo 5, they weren't Halo 2 Anniversary, but they were not in Halo 5, which I find to be weird. Also, I went, huh? Because there are now, uh, Talons, the aircraft from Halo Reach, which still doesn't explain when in the world, <laughs> no, what time are we at? And how does Captain Gether fit in this? Because last time we saw Captain Gether, he was floating away from uh, Shield World um, at the end of Halo Wars. Which, by the way, my Halo Wars playthrough, I just went back and watched it. It's actually not bad. I thought it was way worse, but no, it's just early me YouTubing. Not bad. Uh, I mean, it's not an HD or anything. I was using my Dazzle, so I wish made I might make an HD version of it when I'm doing Heroic, but we'll see. Uh, by the way, Halo Wars 2 Beta. You know what? We talked long enough. Let's get into action. Alright, we got Captain Cutter. And Earthrox. Oh, let's read the things. Captain Cutter. As Captain of the Spirit of Fire, a Cutter can send powerful orbital support, specialized UNC unit drops, and enhanced units already deployed. Okay. And then the other one. Earthrox. Earthrox focuses on cunning and defensive styles supported by events. Economy and power for units, temporal and variable. Okay. Well, we'll do, uh, we'll do, uh, Captain Cutter, as I've always done. Okay, he's good. Clean Japan, uh, Captain Cutter is good at overload drop rating. Oh, I hope I got Captain Cutter. 2v2 Ricochet. The wrath of the Waking Giant scars the land. Uh, okay, I'm good. Okay, I'm good. Captain Cutter. Okay. All right. Everything, everything's good in the world. Everything's good in the world. My nation deems. Fight to capture domination points. Uh, owning, uh, owning points reduces enemy ticket count. Reduce enemy tickets count to zero to win. Oh, by the way, I do have myself and I do myself a party, so no one can. So the, I can hear my teammates and they can hear you, or they can hear me. Which for commenting is terrible. I always feel bad commenting in the open match. It feels so wrong. Uh, and also I don't like people talking to me when I am uh, recording. Also, I don't like that either. Well, this is going to be interesting. First match. I mean, I did play a lot of Halo Wars. And I'm probably, since it's just released, I'm probably going to do a video or two of Halo Wars. Because I never really did Halo Wars skirmish on the channel before waiting for players. Control battles. Batteries are low. Let's change that real quick. All right. That's one. That's two. All right, waiting for players. That is totally, utterly fine. As we're going to change our batteries real quick. 
Not as nearly as fun as changing a 360 control batteries as you can just dump, as you can just, you know, take the battery pack out and then point it towards the trash can and then shake it and it goes out in a satisfactory manner. Uh, unfortunately, you can't do that with Xbox One. Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, now I never, I don't think I ever played Halo Wars competitively. Uh, you know, playing against another human opponent, ever. Actually, yes I have, against friends, but that was it. Alrighty, is everybody ready to go? Because I am sure not. Turn on the controller. Alright, let's hope my guy is really awesome so I don't have to, so I don't have to, uh... Well, I don't have the uh, excellent. Okay, what we need to do is we need. Uh, okay, do we got scout unit? Oh, we got a couple of scout units. Jack Rabbit, that's new. Um, I'll leave that one for right now. This is why you need. Oh, and our Warthog has guns, which is no. Exits to go. Um. Go? Question mark. Now I want to try. There we go. Um, no. Well, I I swore I was listening to Captain Cutter. How do you... Hold it. Hold it! This is gonna be bad. This is gonna be real bad. Um, Yes, you build it, it's like, oh great, don't know. <laughs> you, you, you said unit, you said you could do multiple units, but I don't know how to do that. Okay, well. Also, the game is extremely quiet, I can't even hear it. I might as well pick those up. I mean, the resources are just like any other time. Okay, we want... Oh, yeah, we want supply pads. Generator, what do they do? Okay, Pelican? Hey, look, it's a... You know, it's an original Pelican. They're not using that... Shoddy... That shoddy hind cockpit anymore. Fantastic, I love that. Uh... Supply pad constructed. Sure, make that. That's fine. Where are my, uh, how do I get the vehicle bay? How do I get it though? It doesn't say. Oh, do I need an upgraded base? Generator constructed. I would say so. Oh, we need a generator for, the, for it though. Okay, well that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. All right, go there. Uh, I, yeah, I used to just use local Enemy units, by the way. Domination point e. Hey, that's a power generation unit. We can build a baser, but we don't want to. Local units. Oh, well, he doesn't really sound like he has to cut her. I don't think. And I don't want to have my TV volume so high that you can hear it in the uh, background. Okay, we'll go. Oh, well, a lot of bases we can capture. A lot of bases we can capture. I really hope they're not doing gentlemen's rules of not don't attack yet. Station is leveled up, so now give me a vehicle bay. It says two. Where one? I'll do it. Oh, no, we definitely need the power. Oh, okay, we'll wait for the power. Come on, vehicle bay. I mean, what I used to do with cutters, I used to just use elephants all day long. I guess go up here. Also, remember to bring the warthog along. Local units. That could be useful. Five by five. Stand to Rally point set. Oh, that's not way. No, 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 no. Uh, oh, well, did he slow you down or something? 
Rally point set. Okay, yeah, that's good. I guess we need to watch the tutorial again. Let's hope these uh, spawner guys don't mind. So yeah, it looks like we were on the Ark. How the world did cat? How old did cut the Ark? I don't know. I'll be fast come in minute left LT is power you build these things last time okay I want I want go options yeah I mean it's a beta let's go ahead and right take a base locations left up in global early point down is next to the next one again we've captured domination point D Okay, looks like our guys, our guys moving out. I hope he knows what he's doing. Like point C. Okay, the thing about Halo Wars is the fact that you guys, your guys, actually stay, you know, together. For the most part, it's, it's a feature I love in, uh, I love in RTS is when your guys just stay together. Actually, I have. A Actually, I haven't, I haven't thought of this, but when was the last time I played Halo Wars? I almost got the, almost got the electricities. The original Halo Wars, I mean. All right, so, oh, uh, okay, ah, okay, these are, these are, uh, these, these are the capture points. Uh, I guess, yeah, you can give me yours. Ah, uh, that's fine. I don't care. Okay, I'm getting angry. We got one, we're about to get two. No, we're not about to get two. How about you guys? Hope that no one's at D and go to B. Uh, I have people selected, why aren't. Our allies are attacking uh, the enemy. Oh, that's a, ba that's a bug. Yeah, I I'm not seeing my. You yeah, need to go there, cursor. Oh, that's gonna be annoying. All right, can we now have level two, please? There we go. Oh, oh okay. So the only thing I guess is we're capturing it. Again, the game is extremely quiet. Well, I'm gonna, I don't know what I'm going to have to do in the recording. I don't know why my mic keeps going really low and then really high, then really low and really high. Oh, maybe because I'm still have Skype up. That would be my bad. I don't think it matters, but yeah. Upgrade complete. All right, take level twos up. Let's get back to base. Oh, my vehicle bay. Oh, and air pad. Okay, then just start spamming the good stuff, supply pads. And I guess one of these. No! Ah, uh, ah, uh, no. I got domination point B. Oh, they took C. Fantastic. Hey, no one's with my volume, it keeps going up and down. All right, you guys need to get off B and get moving to. Garage constructed. Okay, moving to A, or to C. Don't know where the enemy's at. They got three bases already. I really don't. I, I can't see my cursor. Uh, again, that's probably a bug report. All right, what can what can we do here? Rain increases units capturing the capture times. Not bad. Battle hardened. All units gain vanguard. Say increase rate. Not bad. Adrenaline uh, fast movement speeds for all non-hero infantry. Not bad. Locust mine drops in cluster. Locust mine on the battlefield. Not bad at all. All right, and these go down the arm rate. Oh, DSTs, we must get all these as possible, like always, because I know how to spam them, and I know how to spam them well. And Mac Blast, too, we need to get our Mac cannons back up online. Yes. Uh, but before that, with, uh, I guess, capture and decapture rates? Sure. And then immediately Mac Blast, don't even Supply ask pass. questions. And then immediately ODST, don't ask questions after that. Oh, we got a Mac Blast ready. 
Look at it creeps. Okay, guys, we're gonna see who's that a. And I got Matt Cannon ready for him. Now, Matt Cannon's are coil guns, by the way, that take up ships. The main, well, the main primary guns of uh, UNC ships, most of them. Most of the UNC ships have one of varying sizes, however, the Infinity has multiple. Like two, forward and aft. Oh, no, two and forward and aft, so and total of four. Generator constructed. Okay, not sure. Oh, that's where it is. He's not really attacking us. Yeah, I hope we're not breaking the gentleman's rules, which I don't know about. Oh, just run. Just run. Oh, you know, they just do that. Okay. Uh, God, keep running, keep running, keep running. Fall back, fall back. How to use abilities again? I swear it was L. I swear it was LB. LT, my bad. Okay, they're falling back. Good. Actually, all you get on LB and then left. And so we do it. Oh, command blunder. Fantastic body skis, please. You know, even if I'm going to drop them, I'm still going to use them. We can drop Clo uh, Clops Cyclopses too and turrets? Cutter! When did you become amazing? Before you just had elephants and ODSTs. And well, and the, and the mech cannon. But now you have dropping Cyclops, which are building units, which you didn't even have in the original. That was just, uh, that's, uh, uh, that's the sergeants. Hey, rest in peace. So, yeah, I'm, I'm standing right. Okay, now we are going to, what are you? Kodiak, artillery. How do we scorpions? Level three. Let's get level three. We're, doing, we're not doing anything with money anyway. Oh, we are not maxed up. Why would we? Can we upgrade these? Yes, we can. Yeah, I'm doing it completely wrong, but Amy's not being very uh, aggressive. Thankfully. You know, like these generators, they're, they're very Halo 5 reach to, uh, uh, tone. Pad upgrade complete. Yeah, upgrade my generator. These are I mean, the only two we have. Can you do anything with the turrets? Or, oh. Oh, we get turrets off the bat. We can do whatever we want through them. I already got it. And new turrets. Mm. Alright, well, while the enemy doesn't want to kill us, let's go. Deal three unlocked. Uh, let's go capture some bases. Reactor upgrade. Coming to the victory. Fantastic. Make sure you get your bases. Yeah. Oh, they have. Yeah, you can see the top left. They have three. We have two. That's not good. We need scorpions. What? Oh, no, we don't need Kodiaks. <coughs> Sorry. X? Yeah, X. We need our scorpions. As most scorpions is always what we need. Kind of shows. Oh, I love Kenster kind of shows. They're amazing. How about here? What do we got? <gasps> the vultures are back! I mean, why would they put their back? As well as night gales, which are, I guess, modernized uh, talons. Uh, let's get some ornaments. Granny gas boost, but no. Uh, <laughs> this game. I wish it was against the eye, but that's about it. I mean, again, it's a beta. Okay, we're going to get, we're going to get this base. Uh, what are we going to get now? And we'll just put tons and tons and tons of supply pads on this one energy. Uh, energy matters now. But yeah, what can we do? Alright, how much do you cost? Army. Oh, we can easily Ready drop. Shit, yeah, we can easily drop these. Uh, I don't, don't want to waste my infantry quite yet. I want to get my... I want to get at least a... A hornet's back. I love my hornets. Why did they ever take them out Halo? Moving. I put them back and only take them out again. Over. Why? How would they? How would they use such a dastardly thing? I hear you, Control. Nation, now that I think about it, that is one ginormous pelican. And using the Heincock one, too, of course it is. Okay, before they used their own thing for deploying bases, but now it's a pelican job. Scorpions, here to break hearts and win war. I got shells holding fire base constructed. Make yeah. track. I'm totally going to turn the bomb because I keep hearing a thing. Can do. Pretty sure they're just talking the same. Okay, we're going to get supplies and generator. Our guy seems to be very passive. Sort of 
supplies, or getting bones, we need more tanks. If you know me, I love my tanks. I love having the most defense tanks in the game for my faction. Uh, what was that? Watch my step. Yes, sir. Fly pad constructed. Just hold on a little longer. We're nearly there. Oh, what? Get to compensation, please. Okay, now we're going to grab another base. Uh, actually, we're going to need to try to fight. I don't want to fight with this army. I actually, we almost have a full unit cap, and we gotta go to the first army too. Um. So yeah. Can we get vulture? Oh yes, we can. No, John, we're going to get vulture. Uh, but we also can't you get the air upgrade. Can't get the air upgrade. Okay, never mind. Get the canister shells. I should get the canister shells. We're going to get the canister shells, canister shells in a second. Looks like the resources coming in are not that bad. Uh, not nearly as they don't. They're not nearly as slow as they were in Halo Wars. But we, yeah, we need to go now, 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 now. Um. Local units. Okay, our guys are attacking. Good job, good job, team. Ready. You know, I'm gonna send this one to Oh, I know what. And ah! Fire the mech blast. How do you do such a thing? Is he drop? The ODSDs have arrived. Which rest of the squadron? Oh no. That didn't work. Ah, that's why. Yeah, they just had too much of an army. They were turtling hard. And again, like, I'm not getting any feedback because I came here a bloody thing. The brain volume is so low. Okay, get more supply points. Okay, so the base that you get. Don't. Ah, uh, that's the turret. That's fine. Also, it's a little buggy, but it's fine. It is an early beta. Ah, oh, they're going to be coming to us next. Um, we're going to need our tanks. I'm going to build one. I'm not really used to this game. That's the problem. And they just thrust you into multiplayer, too. Well, Imagine if the enemy team did not wait for us. And our ODSTs can't Start handle it. I mean, they're not fully upgraded ODSTs in the original game. Okay, where's the dumb Vulture? Ah, there you are. Go kill things, Vulture. Over. I, have, I believe in you, Vulture. Copy. Over. Oh, these guys. Oh, that's a lot of infantry. Need an aircraft. I have my doubts. It's a Vulture, but I have my doubts. Oh, you know what? Maybe we should build barracks. I can upgrade our own STDs. Oh, but no, but I mean, Vultures were like the antithesis of awesome. Uh, but no longer. Our allies' base is under attack. Turret constructed. Okay, where is the Vulture? Nah. But yeah, the game is a lot different than it used to be. Very familiar, but again, very, very different. Again, they don't give you a single skirmish to get to go to get set up, which I don't like. I don't I, I don't mind it in, uh, in FPSs are easy enough to understand, but for game for RTSs for MOBAs for yeah RTSs and MOBAs basically, they do need it. They do need it bad. Ultimate edition. So there is another edition of Halo Wars. Um. Sure, let's see what it is, because I don't know. First time you see me actually look at Ultimate Edition. Hopefully I can buy it at, hopefully I can pre-order at GameStop instead of having to do it here. Uh, do you like my physical edition? Yeah, welcome to ARK. Yeah, I figured as much. The ARK returns, and look, it's on damage, like I said. It would be, because the ARK is too awesome to die. Alright, welcome to
Welcome to Ark, was this? The Banished, eh? Okay, so this DLC has story missions and multiplayer later. It's the Banished. So they're at the Ark and their Covenant. Interesting. Oh, I multiplayer this in the original Halo Wars 2 campaign. Wait, are you saying that there are leaders from from the campaign that are not going to be a multiplayer unless you get this pack? Interesting. Wait, how much is this? $79 for the pack and then season pass. Not bad. Not bad. The average rate. Uh, well, average for like Ubisoft. Alright, so there's only like the Covenant Heroes thing where you get different, where you get DLC leaders as part of the DLC. Interesting. Uh, is that right? Yeah, that's about right. But I think like, on the heroes, I mean, Cup of the Heroes, too, of course. Uh, I was thinking, like, is it? Do they do that in, uh, do they do it in Command and Conquer 4? No. <laughs> Command and Conquer 4 just has the two factions and you just get your units as they go and there is no DLC stuff at all. Well, that's interesting. I will be getting that. Uh, I'm just going to wait for Halo. I'm just going to wait for E3 to be over to pre-order things because E3. Uh, a lot of things are going to get done. Like, already, you can pre-order now what you couldn't do before E3. You can now pre-order Titanfall 2. You can now pre-order Halo Wars 2. And let me see if you can pre-order Mass Effect Andromeda right now. As it was a, you know, they did have a trailer at E3. So, yeah. But we are running out of time, aren't we? So, um, yeah, what do I think of Halo Wars 2 open beta? Well, if you like RTSs, if you like multiplayer online RTSs, and if you like, uh, you know, uh, you know, if you like Halo, uh, I mean, uh, I mean, if you're bad at multiplayer RTSs, it's not going to change. Of course, you play with friends, which is entirely possible, I think. Can you play with friends, question mark? Uh, I don't know. No, can, uh, you can't promote that yet, but I'm sure you might be able to at the end of E3. But yeah, so I love Halo Wars 2 right now. I just feel it does feel like an evolution of the game. It doesn't feel like they took the game, decided, you know what, we want to make a sequel. Here's a sequel. Yeah, some things. No, they changed it a lot. With that, but they changed it in such a way to make it familiar. Uh, you know, basically doing the anti-Command and Conquer way, or yeah, I guess doing it the StarCraft way, because StarCraft 2 is very familiar to StarCraft 1, as far as I can tell. Whereas Command and Conquer changes in every iteration. Um, they, I would say, if I were to compare it to something that is close to this, I would say Battlefield is actually the closest series in terms of evolution that I can see between Halo Wars and Halo Wars 2. Because in Battlefield, where the base gameplay, where the base gameplay themes the same, but the settings are different, you know, and just they just have different engines for the most part. They add a bunch of new features, but the game still full feels very familiar at Halo Wars 2. Um, they did a really good job. I mean, it's still beta. We had the little X bug and the fact that the audio is so quiet I can't hear it. I mean, it doesn't help that these headsets are very noise canceling in both the mic department and the headset department. Uh, but even then, I have like the TV volume at like 40 something. I can barely hear cut, uh, cut or talk. So I'll definitely be in for experience once I actually start listening to it um, in editing to see what it actually sounds like. But yeah. I mean, people have been wanting Halo Wars 2 for a long time. They finally got it, and it's coming out next year. It's coming out January next year, hopefully. Uh, but, yeah, I actually can't wait for it. Uh, but I will have been playing more of these. Hopefully, I I won't die. After, uh, well, I'll keep playing them until I get good about that. Because we do got, what, 20 days? No, we got sep No. Yes, we got seven days until... Uh, we got seven days until the end of the beta, so we might as well make the best of it, eh? Uh, I still gotta do Mirror's Edge Callus before the 21st, and let that Technomancer comes out, then I gotta do, I mean, Technomancer, and maybe I'm getting Umbrella Corps, or Umbrella Corps, and then you got Star Ocean coming out the 28th, Ar Armor 3 Epics coming out, I don't know when, but that's probably not gonna be more than gameplay videos, but yeah. For whatever reason, all the new games decided to come out, or, you know, all the weird games decided to come out on, uh, in spring and summer, which is odd. All the good, you know, all the, all the, like, long-weed sequels came out last year, now they're doing, like, starts of new franchises and, uh, 
uh, you know, and just general RPG games coming out spring and summer. As well as indie games coming out in Steam, which is weird. But anyway, so yeah, I do like Halo Wars too. Uh, they did a good job. Still a beta, but they did, your, good, they did a good job and we'll be doing more of it. I'm not right now because I'm out of time for tonight, but anyway, so yeah, that'll be it for this, so that'll be it for this video. Thanks for watching. Do be sure, I do be sure to go watching out of this video. Did you ask me? Most people have me, most people have me to, if you to leave a comment, they should take the additions for a series. This is more like be a as this is more or less going to be a series at this point. Oh yeah, um, the orc, not the orc guy, um, the bird guy, I would probably play him, maybe. Uh, I would probably play him just to show him off, because... I like the Chieftain of Halo Wars, he was fun. Um, but I like the Prophet more. Uh, with his glass in game. Uh, and I didn't like the Covenant that much for their build style, well, it was weird to me. I didn't I didn't like the build style at all, but you know, I might as well try to try him. But we'll bet we're definitely be playing Captain Ketter until I figure out how the in the world the game works. And let's hope we don't go up against lots of people. But anyway, so yeah, um, that, I also appreciate this and I'll play Halo Wars 2 beta and you don't know tips to do this. To me, it's coming for for build tool tip, and I guess see you in a skin.